Originally, Plang has an uncle, right? Right. Yeah, who has bile duct cancer. So we wanted to know what was going on. So we went and researched about bile duct cancer and found that 85% of bile duct cancer is caused by liver fluke infections in Thailand. And 20,000 people every year die by bile duct cancer too. Uh, like is especially in the northern and the northeast of Thailand, which is around the neighborhood. Like a lot of people die because of this disease. Right. Yeah, and there's like this organization called CASCAN, which is Thailand's cholangiocarcinoma. Cholangiocarcinoma. Yeah, bile duct cancer uh, center in Thailand, which practically diagnoses patients who are at risk of having um, liver fluke infections. But their diagnosis is slow, like really, really slow, because they're only able to do so to 0.17% of the risky population. Yeah, and we also went there and see the real working condition, how slow it was and how painful it is to look into, look into the microscope and count the OB8, which we were able to look through the microscope also. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So we wanted to solve this problem and thought that, hey, maybe AI can help like improve it and make it faster. So there, it started from there and then all of a sudden, boom, Bidex got created. Bidex originally is or was going to be called Fluke Finder, yes. right? Fluke yes. Finder. <laughs> With like the logos, F with F. <laughs> yeah, yeah, F the, logo F F. F. the FF project. Yes. But when it comes to an F, uh, our mind removed. It might not be like to, to that somehow bad bad words. Yeah, yeah. Right. So we change the name by like combine some of the words that uh, included in our project. Yeah. So the first sound that we pronounce is bi. It came from bile duct cancer, uh, the disease that we are going to help the doctor or the organization to detect it using AI. And the second one is dex. The D is from the duct from bile duct cancer, but for the X, there are two meanings behind it. Like the first one is explore because we are going to use AI to explore the image of the stool sample to find the liver fluke egg. But the second meaning is the egg because we are going to find the egg. Oh yeah, by the egg. By yeah, the egg, by the egg. But with the X, uh, I, like, I like the sound, sound of the X. Yeah, the X like by the X. It's, it's cooler than by the egg. More concise too. Yes. So that's why we choose by the X as our name. Ah, yeah, well, it's really funny. So basically, we have a virtual machine running on Google Cloud, right? And it kept on like taking our credits, consuming our money. So we left it on for a while and all of a sudden, boom. Not for a while, like six months. Six months. <laughs> <laughs> so we're all like checking our emails and yeah. Yeah, and so it ate all of our money. We have to thank the school, the Prince Soros College, for supplying <laughs> us with money to pay for these things. Like, yes hosting, and so many other things, including this. This? Yes. 
Well, uh, it started in three years ago in NSC when we were trying to pitch projects and form teams. We were doing these things and all of a sudden, well, we found ourselves together, pitched a project and it ran, continued to run. Yeah. yeah. Somehow we just end up together. Yes. Us three. And here we are until now. Like, I guess that because like the pitching project that uh, each of us pitched three years ago, uh, there was a similarity between it. Like, uh, all of us focus on doing in the medical field that using AI or using technology to help enhance the uh, sufficiency or the quality of the treatment. And when we end up together, we still focus on the medical field to use AI to help in the diagnosis process. Yes. Oh, we would like to say that we sometimes discourage and felt anxious, especially when like we run the code and it's got a bug. The program could not work and disabled our goal. But we don't really feel pressured at all because like we could not do other things than keep working and going forward. Yes, yes. Code bugs are really a problem. Yeah, yeah we, 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 we encounter them all the time. Oh, uh, basically, well, we are the group of noise. We... Blow. We never shut up. <laughs> oh yeah, we, we never <laughs> shut up. Like, every time during our working process, we love to play jokes. We, like, type one word and then play like 10 jokes and then go back to work. Or sometimes we like just horsing around the room until we were tired and get back to work with a restarted brain. Yeah. We were pretty shocked actually because we didn't anticipate it it to be like we didn't expect our project to be this much received and um, when they announced the award my eyes went wild because I didn't really have enough sleep the night before yes. <laughs> um, so it was pretty the experience was pretty intense and filled with um, dopamine yeah they were uh, partying all night yes yes uh, like yes. we we like almost sleep in front of the like the ceremony when they pass like the fourth place the third place. Uh, we didn't think that we're gonna receive that that high award yeah. like this. Well, something something has been lost along the way, like. We spent a lot of time on this project, but everything that has been lost um, just couldn't match up with um, what we get in the end. Made um, a meaningful impact to the society, and we made a lot of friends along the way. Yeah, we also got a chance, uh, an opportunity to improve our project even further too. Yeah. There's a lot of people that are interested in our project. Uh, especially like in the international level of the competition uh, it contains a lot of people who have like some kinds of interested things like similar with us so it is interesting and it is great to like trade all what we lost to what we gonna receive Our work can continue on, yeah, it can. Because, well, we received an opportunity actually, right? An opportunity to continue on working with relevant organizations. 
We believe our work will be able to help hospitals with diagnosis, especially with liver fluke infections. Because uh, normally, even hospitals, doctors have to look through a microscope into a stool sample to find liver fluke eggs, which is something which our AI can do. Yeah. And like, we can also put our model of proactive diagnosis using the artificial intelligence or the AI with uh, the web application or the program to be used in the way of diagnose other disease other than liver fluke infection. Maybe like lung disease or even COVID-19 or like the future pandemic that may happen. Uh, we guess that we could not list all of the people who have uh, helped us in this project Bidex, but for all, we would like to thank everyone who gave us the opportunity that helped us to accomplish the work. Well, we could not like finish or getting much these recognitions or awards like this without your help. So thank you everyone who were behind us. We recognize, we know all of your efforts and all of your positive energy that give to us and bring us to be right here. Thank you. Um, for those who are working, pursuing their projects, their dreams, and whatever meaningful to them, I would say be passionate and enjoy what you're doing. Just don't give up and keep doing your stuff. Because in the end, every, every effort that you put in will matter. So just don't give up. Just don't give up. Don't give up.